Hello, Richard Dick Coughlin, 666. How are you? This is going to be the last video I do um, addressing uh, my suspension from the Coughlin 666 channel. After this, I, what I'm going to be doing is I will be uploading some of my old videos from my other channel, but I will be interspersing them with new videos as I go along. Now, a lot of people are asking if there's anything they can do to help the situation, if there's anything they can help me out with. Well, I've had some ideas. You can send emails to YouTube. You can email them at service at youtube.com. If you're on Twitter, another thing you could do is, because YouTube have a Twitter account, you can send them a Twitter. We could do a tweet bomb, as it's called. Um, and you can so on Twitter just put at YouTube, please reinstate Coffin 666. You can do all of that. I also, but I want to talk about some other things that happen when you get suspended. Now, first of all, a lot of people complain about mirrors. Let me explain why mirroring videos is important in some cases. There have been instances in recent months, mainly it's a, a, some that spring to mind, a sardonic skeptic, and oh my god, it's Chris. Videos of theirs were suspended people mirrored them and they were reinstated. Mirroring a video not only brings attention to, lots of attention to the video, and in my case, attention to let people know that my channel is no longer up. Because I always see people complaining, oh, God, my subscription box is filled with the same video. Didums, right? It's a day's inconvenience. Sorry, but let me explain that, right? Let's put it this way. If YouTube, if everyone on YouTube who made videos for one day, everyone uploaded the same video. Do you think the YouTube would like that? No, they wouldn't. Why? Because no one would watch the other videos. So you've got all this bandwidth being taken up, and you've got nobody watching it. In short, when you mirror videos, send a message to YouTube, and it costs them money, and they're not in a position to want that to happen. And it sends a message that, look, you know, if you silence us once, will speak back 500 times louder. And I want to talk again about this thing about, because there were some people, I'm not going to mention anyone, they know who they are, who went on about, oh God, it's only YouTube, you can get it. Yeah, it's only YouTube. What does that mean when you say it's only YouTube? You realize there's, a, because of this website, um, there are people on here who put effort, some of us care about the stuff we make. Some of us care about what this does for us. Now, for me, yes, there was a financial side to it. I was earning money, and I'm now not earning that money, and that is a bummer. And when people mirror videos, whilst it might be inconvenient for some of us, that is the real community on YouTube. That is the community element, the same way where if your friend loses a job, you'll lend them some money. If someone's house is robbed, you lend them something, you give them something, you do whatever you can. That's the real community. And in the last um, couple of days, the people who have come out in support of me range from everyone. I've had, you know, there have been Christians like Abby Normal One, Bossman 103, Together for Peace, uh, Rational Roundtable, come, have come out and supported me and mirrored videos of mine. There have been conservatives who have helped me out, people like uh, Sardonic Skeptics, another one. There are people on the liberal side of it who have helped me. There are people on the anarchist side, people like, in the end, I was right, uh, helped, me out on, helped me out with it. People on the feminist side, the, the, the fem Nazis, you know, people like Nuclear Knight and, um, and uh, Diana Boston and um, Antique Lens, they helped me out. People on the other side of the feminist debate, my video was featured on Zombie's channel. It was featured, you know, uh, Peach did a mirror for him. Darwa Films helped me out. People on the science side of the debate, male rights activists have helped me out on this. Black people, white people. I even got messages from people like Truthful Christian, that, you know, saying, I hope I get everything goes okay and I get my account reinstated. Even, there's even a guy on here called Martin J. Willett, who is the possibly the biggest Pat Condell fan on the planet. He hates me. And even he made a video demanding that I be reinstated. There have been Wiccans and Pagans and every other sort of person. And that, at moments like that, that is the community working as one. If only we hadn't excommunicated Condell, maybe he'd have given a shit to. But the point is, when people say this is only YouTube, they're not. There's people on here who 
are friends of mine who I know through this website. This website is the only th time I get to see a lot of them. There's people on it who I've spoken to hour after hour on the phone with, people who, I, people who I'm friends with, people who've been there for me, people who I've helped out, people who have helped me out, people who I've spent time with, people who I love, and they're here, and when something happens, we're there for each other. And I'm sorry if it annoys some of you, and if some of you think it doesn't matter. And some of you might have the old, well, his account will get reinstated anyway. Yeah, but you know what? What if it doesn't? Isn't it good to do something and get nothing? Then do nothing and know that nothing is going to happen. So, for all those whinging and complaining, get over it. Because when, you, when this happens to you, you be grateful for the people who are doing it for you as I am grateful for the hundreds of people who've, ca who've called out and spoken on my behalf. This wasn't just a channel for me, this was an outlet. This was a way I could, I could talk to people and I could learn. Uh, and I could put a message across that I felt needed to be heard. And if you think that's nothing, right, then that says more about you than it does about me. Richard the Dick Coughlin, 616. Thank you, good night, may God be less.